So then from that experience, I believe your two sisters began their own sort of organization to help other seniors. Can you talk about that? Yeah, they wanted to help other seniors get online. So my two sisters started going to a local retirement residence and giving the seniors lessons. And they started just asking their school friends, people in their classes, if they wanted to tag along. And I think there was a group of about 15 of them that would go to the retirement residence two days a week after school and give hour-long lessons to the seniors. What was in it for, you know, I'm dating myself calling them the young people, but the younger generation, the millennials or the generation Y, people that, what did they feel compelled to, to give back to these seniors? What was the reason? I think the main driving reason for a lot of the students who join in this program in the beginning is uh, taking on a leadership role in their communities, uh, which looks really great on college applications and job applications. So. Uh, my sisters also did it for community service hours. They needed to get 100 community service hours in order to graduate high school. So they were looking for interesting ways to help out in their community. Um, but I think, you know, once the students get into it, they end up teaching for longer than they need to to fulfill those 100 hours community service because they just enjoy it. I mean, it's fun and I think they start to realize they really like helping out in their community. And this is something that comes naturally to them. So it's not a difficult thing for them to do to give these computer lessons. Yeah, Cyber Seniors shows such great moments between the two generations on the computer. And you did see this relationship develop amongst all of them. And it was, it was really sweet to see, you know, how, quote, faster the younger generation was. And then the older generation was, oh, how did you do that? You make this go so fast, please, you know. And it was great to see the relationship between the two of them. How did uh, the seniors sign up? Like, what was their reasoning? They hear about the internet, it sounds like they were scared of it a little bit, but they were still intrigued. What was their reasoning, did they tell you? Yeah, I think for a lot of them, they, they hear so much about the internet. They say, you know, my kids live in front of their computers, my grandkids live in front of their computers, and I don't know anything about it. I want to know a little bit more about what's going on. Definitely the driving factor for them was getting in touch with family. They wanted to, they see their grandkids on Facebook all the time, so they want to be on Facebook too. They want to be able to Skype with them and communicate with them.